penalty shootout again. He starts this one at White Hart Lane against Ian Walker and he buries it. And he's quite prepared to take a bow, even though uh, there are not too many cheers for him behind that particular goal. 1 0 to Forrest. A year ago, Clive Wilson, with a penalty, put Queen's Park Rangers into the quarter final against Millwall. And indeed, QPR have certainly missed Clive's expertise from the penalty spot in recent weeks. But he's failed for Tottenham, Mark Crossley, who saved that Gary Lineker penalty in the 1991 FA Cup final at Wembley, has saved here from Wilson, Brian Roy. Is the second player to step up for Frank Barr. And Walker makes a pretty comfortable stop. This to level it at 1 1. Another stop by Crossley, who went a long way and read Rosenthal's mind. Wone, who scored a penalty in the FA Cup this season at Oxford. into Walker's net 2-0 to Forrest well this is unstoppable perhaps if the keeper stands his ground doesn't move he may get his hand to it but I would think the force of the shot would still have beaten Walker Rule Fox and he hammers it past Crossley no change for Nottingham Forest in that respect because it's going to be Steve Chettle and he scores! Nottingham Forest are getting very close indeed. Terrific power, terrific accuracy. So it rests for Tottenham with Teddy Sheringham. Mark Crossley saved the penalty from Sheringham in the league game here last season. They're through to the quarter-finals thanks to a magnificent display of goalkeeping in the shootout by Mark Crossley, who sets off for the Forest fans at the other end of the ground. He saved from Wilson, he saved from Rosenthal, and here he saves from Teddy Sheringham. Well, that's a magnificent save. Sheringham strikes it, accurate enough with power.